what is up everybody we are live appreciate everyone who has joined us we are doing another live sports card auction as you guys probably have noticed by the thumbnail we'll be doing this every single sunday and we are rotating channels so guys if you haven't subscribed yet to my buddy nate every day i'm hustling or my buddy paul gate city picker slash gate city sports cards we're gonna get that gate city sports cards channel up over 100 subscribers so we can do some stuff over on his channel as well so if you guys could show him a little love over there i'd appreciate that but yeah we're gonna have tons of cheap auctions today we'll even have graded stuff we have sealed products we have a little bit of everything for you guys so if there's any players teams or anything like that you guys are interested in all you gotta do is let us know we can grab it for you uh we're just kind of waiting on a few people to trickle in if you could if you have social media if you could share this out for us we'd greatly appreciate that just so we let people know that we are live and showing off some cards and some great deals What are you watching, fellas? Watching the uh, end of the Steeler game right now. First time. This, game, this game has been like a completely different game in the second half than it's been in the first half. Like, I feel like the Monstars like lost the Steelers' talent. <laughs> and, we're coming and, then back. They and then they found it in the second half. Exactly. Yep, so we got we got under two minutes left, guys. Under two minutes left. Steelers are up four. They're on defense. It's fourth down and six right now, guys. So the Steelers have a chance to end the game right here. Indy's out of timeouts. Oh! There's a flag, but he picked it, didn't he? Yeah. Well, I hope you don't have a heartbreak like I did for the Raiders game. Anybody watched the end of that Raider game knows that it's hard being a Raiders fan sometimes. Yeah. They were, they were talking about if Gruden wasn't uh, on a 10-year contract like he is, they probably would have probably fired him after, uh, I think, the last two games. How it kind of ended, I believe, was two out of three, something like that. Yes. Yesterday's game – Yesterday's game wasn't uh, anything to do with him. And the, I, don't, I understand the field position game that they played, but uh, there were two plays at the end of the game where Josh Jacobs, you know, sat down, you know, before the end of the end zone to keep the clock running so they could kick the field goal and win. Sorry, if you got an opportunity to cross the goal line, you, you cross the goal line, you know, especially in a close game like that. And two times he sat down and, and you know, Gave gave you know the Dolphins the opportunity, and then just a a, a bad luck you know hand to the face mask, you know uh, rushing the quarterback thing, and, and then the receiver caught it, and then tacked on 15 yards, put him right in field goal position. This is just bad luck, bad luck at the end of that game. Yeah, horrible. Yeah, I, I just I, I heard them talking about on the radio or like local you know, sports radio show or whatever. And uh, there was some type of call that they, that they were saying that uh, basically they, they were blaming on Gruden or whatever. And I, I don't know if yeah. was, like, you're talking about like the field position or, or something else, but I didn't. I don't know from that game, the, the Chargers game, yeah, there were some questionable, questionable things that happened in that Chargers game. Yeah. Dude. Coming down to it again. So, Glenn, how's your uh, Saints doing today, man? Uh, didn't they play last or That's yesterday? right. They did play the other day because they uh, benched Kirk Cousins against them. So, yeah, they must have not played too well. Now you're 
Appreciate everyone that is with us. Uh, this first lot we're going to show off. I'm just going to start showing a few things uh, while we wait on more people to trickle in. Uh, you can see I have a Brooklyn Nets lot here. It's a Kevin Durant, Kyrie Irving, and Kyrie Irving. Three-card lot. We're going to start that at $1. Anyone is interested in the Brooklyn Nets lot starting at $1. You get the Kevin Durant base. Uh, again, first Nets jersey, so that's definitely something that is going to be desirable. And then you got two Kyrie Irving Nets inserts as well, the give and go and the will to win. So it's a nice little lot starting at one doll hair. Anyone is interested in that, you let us know. We also have some sealed products here. We got uh, two blasters left of the Prism draft picks. Those are $34. Or for $13, we have a playoff solo pack. If anyone's interested in that, you guys want to have some fun, we could do like a uh, just little cheap buy in break for it and do divisions or something like that. I'm also going to be giving away this pack of 1991 score football. So that's going to be given away to someone here during the live stream. So definitely stay tuned for that. That'll be given away. You can either have me open it and, you know, anything good will get sleeved and top loaded, or I can send it to you. You can open it yourself. Got a Sam Darnold here, Gem Mint from Beckett. That's uh, starting at twenty dollars too. If anyone's interested in Sam Darnold, so again, guys, we're at one dollar on the net slot. If anyone is interested, if not, we can cycle through to a few other things. Though we're still waiting on a few people to. Come on through. I know a lot of people are still watching these NFL games because the 1 o'clock games are still dragging out, especially my stallers. CBC in the house. What up, big guy? What up, man? He says his Jags did glorious today. Not good, not great, but glorious. What's up, Cliff? Yeah, dude, I didn't realize you were a Jags fan. I guess I just assumed you'd be something California. Well, maybe they, maybe like us Raider fans, we have to hide sometimes. <laughs> yeah, it makes sense. So again, guys, the uh, net slot is one dollar. I'm going to give you just another second or so to ponder that. If you're not interested, we will switch over to Paul Gate City here in just a second. Ooh, Purdy. Oh, you're on me already? Yep. Oh, it's still kind of... Got a little Tops Gallery auto lot here. Um, get these set. Hopefully that one will sit right there. Um, let's see. Jonathan Vil uh, Vilmer auto. These are sticker autos from the 2020 Tops Gallery. This is a Stephen Gonzalez, Stephen Gonzalez, I believe. Here's an uh, Andres uh, Monzer, I think that's how you uh, say it. And then this is a short print of Derek Rodriguez. This is 22 of 50. I'm going to focus on there from the camera. So it's a blue short print. Start this lot here at mm, three. So three bucks will get a starting bid on that one. Let's see if we can get anybody bidding on this. Oh, yeah. Steelers won, baby. Makes me feel good. Oh, 
Mm-hmm. Any specific sport or anything you guys would like to see? We got a little bit of everything. Yeah, I'll have some uh, basketball CVC. Uh, let me see what I can cycle through here. Get you. Uh, plenty, CVC, plenty. I, got a, I got a ton of basketball, man. Basketball? That's like the only thing I don't have. Really? You don't have no basketball? That's <laughs> good. <laughs> I was going to say. Any uh, uh, particular teams or series sets or anything like that? Uh, I can throw a couple things up here. Um, here, I'll throw, I'll, I'll do this right here. see anybody any advance on these so i'll pull these down maybe i'll bring them back up when we see if we can get some more people to cycle in here um see some over here how about some some dennis rodman how's that sound uh this is a uh what year is this 1998 uh memorable moments die cut dennis rodman uh how about some uh, what is this one? This is Superstar of the Court from 1998. This is a two, the same card. Pull that stand out of the way. Two of the same card. And then here is a holograph. Um, this is a star focus. Um, 1997 upper deck. Uh, may not be able to see, but this is see-through. Let me see if I can get a light on this. But it's got a uh, see-through hologram there. You can see Dennis Rodman there. Start that at a two, $2 spot on that. So that's also kind of a die cut. It's uh, Upper Deck uh, 3 is what uh, Upper Deck series that is. Dude, that's awesome, CBC. Leave that there, fish there, fish that out there, or put that out there for a while, and then I'll throw. A, I got a one card, uh, one baseball card. I'll put up for now and see if I can get anybody to go on that. Is there any baseball fans in there? Pass on a worm, all right. Throw these back in the cellar later. All right, so the baseball card I'll put up. This is um, 2020 Panini uh, Contenders, a rookie ticket two. Card 154 of Sam Hilliard. This is a redemption card. You'll have to scratch it off and send that into old Panini to see uh, what you get from it. Um, but it's uh, it's his auto. It's an auto card, is what it is. It's just a redemption. Leave that up there for a little bit. See if anybody wants that one. There we go. Got Keith Moore in it, too, on that. Hey, Kenneth. Good to see you, man. Appreciate oh, you. Kenneth, too. I'm sorry. Glance down. I'm 
I'm also watching another auction, another online auction, not a YouTube auction. So clicking back and forth between a couple screens here. Yep, Browns lost. I kind of figured that was coming once like half of their team was out with the COVIDs. Today was a good day. Hey, uh, Anthony, you got the uh, scroll across the bottom with their email addresses on it? You know what? I should. Yeah, let me put that up. I know I should bet on the Jets today. Jets on a little winning streak. That's what they do at the end of the season. They finally realize, oh, wait, it's not preseason anymore. Like like Pittsburgh was saying, they had 70 people on the COVID and injury list, especially on offense with receiver. Like yeah. they already have OD, uh, Odell Beckham Jr. out. Then they had Jarvis Landry out, Peoples Jones out, T. Higgins out. I mean, basically they had no – NFL starter, uh, you know, type of receivers on their team today. So they had to rely basically on on Hunt and uh, Chubbs to get the, the job done. So and then they were getting six and a half. So I was telling Anthony, like, I should bet on this game, but I'm not. Just because, yeah, you never know. Gary <laughs> V would be happy. All right, I'm going to go ahead and call this sold to uh, Kenneth. All right. We going to Nate? Yeah. So we got lots of lots of, of graded stuff. And if anyone's interested in anything, just ask. I'll give you a price to buy it now and that type of stuff. But we will auction off this Pete Alonzo baseball lot, four card lot, starting at a buck. And his name is Pete, and he bought the meat. You know it. He got his Diamond Kings Donruss. And you got two cups and then a, a league leaders. Justin, what's up, man? Good to see you. Appreciate you being here, bud. It has been a while, man. We're going to have to catch up. Hopefully you had a good Christmas. I'll try and show you guys these slabs, too, while we're uh, seeing if anybody wants the feet lot. So there's a rookie Ben Simmons 95 BGS. We have a rookie Prism Brandon Ingram nine and a half Beckett. Terry Owens 2002 playoff absolute. Kobe hidden gems. We have a 1980 tops John Stallworth and a seven. Boom. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> Domino. That's part of the reason why I took my stands down. I had, uh, when we were doing the morning show, I used to have them up all the time. Just yeah. Like, out. And I need better stands. These light, light plastic ones just don't cut it. Kobe, Hen and Jim's from 2000. Tops. Little Brady action out of ten. Another ten in the Brady.
John Morant, Draft Prism, 9, PSA. Anybody interested? Bueller. No, nah, not half price, Cliff. That's why it's nice having these cards in in case like this. They're pretty uh, durable once they're bound in the cases. All right, we're going to pass. Good, Pittsburgh. Okie doke. I got another $1 lot for you guys here. This is uh, Ky Blah, not Kyrie, Kawhi Leonard. We have four of his cards here, uh, all from, I believe, actually, I believe one of them's from 2018 and the rest are from 2019. So we got a Don Rust. We have a Hoops. We have an Optic. And we have a Court Kings. So that starts at $1. If anyone's interested, you get all four Kawhi Leonard's for one doll hair. Any interest? And again, we will be giving away the 91 score here at some point. And we got other sealed wax if anyone's interested. But yeah, we're at $1 on the Kawhi's. Anyone's interested, just let us know. And again, if there's a certain player, certain sport, certain time frame, like I have, you know, we have cards going all the way back to the 70s, maybe even older. We have cards all the way up to this year. So just let us know what you're looking for. We probably have it. And I know most of you guys probably came here looking for a grandmama card. You know your boy got them grandmamas, Converse. You know about those Larry Johnson OG Converse cards. Are those the cards that came free with the shoes? <clears throat> I think so. I don't know. <laughs> Bye, front row. 1993 Converse. Yeah, I think there was a, a series where the few basketball players that Converse had under contract, you could get a card if you bought their shirt. I might have to send that to SGC just because of the black trim. <laughs> and that'll be like my like Bill Cosby type card. Right. So I'm not seeing any love on my man Kawhi. I'll give you just another second on that one. Just to percolate. I'm going to throw up a Giannis lot right quick. Unless you were ready, Paul. Just trying to uh, I got a few things I can okay. bounce yeah. around up there, see if anybody wants. Uh, how about a little bit of uh, Topps Gold Label Lamar Odom Rookie? How does that sound for anybody there? Oh, nice. So That's like pre-cocaine addiction. <laughs> this is uh, this is pre. What's it? What was his? Uh, what were them sisters' names? Uh, Kardashians. Kardashians. Yes, this is pre Kardashians. Uh, Two thousand. Start that at a big old buck. Nobody likes that. I got a little bit of a shack lot. I'll throw up here. The five card shack lock next, and then I've got some pack fresh, pack fresh football. I'll put up. Uh, nice. We'll move down.
Stuff on. <laughs> I gave you a piece of paper. Okay. I gotta get the boys um gift cards. Okay. Okay. You're gonna... hey, I got some movement on this Lamar Odom rookie for a buck, so any other movement on it will keep this going kind of quickly. What's up, Deafness? Thanks for coming. Hey, Deaf. Appreciate it, man. Thanks so much for being here. Uh, right now, right now we got ourselves a Lamar Olam Gold label from Tops Rookie Up for bid. CVC is on it for a dollar so far. You guys aren't familiar with deafness guys he's going to be going live right after us he's a really awesome sports card channel definitely make sure you go and check him out deafness 45 all right no movement on this so far so i'll go ahead and, and give this on to cvc and then I'll throw up. This is pack fresh. This is pulled today. Uh, you guys, you guys in the chat, are seeing this um, right out of the pack. Uh, Anthony and Nate saw this earlier. Got a Van Jefferson Great Expectation patch from Illusions. This year's Illusions, as well as his base rookie card. Roll those for two bucks. If anybody is interested in that, these are pack fresh pulled today. Start that at two dollars. Is that a jersey? Yeah, that's a jersey patch. Yes, that's awesome. Let me let me double check or read the back here. I'm pretty sure it is a jersey patch. It closes an authentic memorabilia. Yep, this doesn't say jersey or, or uh, pants, but I'm gonna assume that's probably pants. Because of the material. Mm -hmm. uh, CVC, got to put his name on this card before I lose track of it. CVC, I do have some Jacob Eason. Jacob Eason. Did I pull any of that from that illusion rip I did? I'll come around. Let's see. So, is he Bills or Giants? Stephanus is in it too. Um, Eason is Colts. Colts, okay. You're thinking of Fromm. He's the Bills guy. Fromm, yeah, yeah, Fromm. Here's what I'm thinking of. Well, hey, look at this. I was going through some of the other stack. I got another Van Jeffers rookie. I'll throw that in there as well. Cool. We got definite in it too on that lot. Oh, good. What did I do with that stack of illusions? Nope. Oh, I thought I had an Easton, but I do not. I do need to sleeve these. Like I said, I just pulled these uh, just before oh, a couple hours ago. Thanks, Steph. I appreciate that, man. Really do. Means a lot. Uh, so I got put pop those in some top loader. So no more moving on this from what I see. Um, 
So I will go ahead and call this sold to death. And uh, we move on to Nate if you're ready. If not, I'll can pop something else up there if you're not ready. Yeah. So I have a three card Sammy Sosa lot. Sosa. Sosa. Baseball's been very, very good to me. Started two bucks. Are any of those rookies? Uh, the Fleer is a rookie, and I believe that Don Russ is a rookie as well. I think all three of these are rookies. Is that tops? What is that? Um, is that update or regular? It's hard to. You're a little far away. Yep. No, that is a rookie. I'm sorry. Yeah. All three are rookies. Points the Big Ben score for you today, Panther. I gotta double check to be honest with you. I haven't even checked again yet. He got three three touchdowns, I think. Yep. Yeah, he definitely came back and like actually did something for me. <coughs> All right, looks like we got no interest on the Sosas. Go ahead and pass. Okay. All right, guys, so we have a Giannis lot here. We're going to start that off at $5 for all three of those Giannis cards. Also got Jacob Eason here. We can start him off at a dollar. Anyone is interested in the Jacob Eason? Which our sports wants, I believe, Nate to do his uh, YouTube face. Oh, the, the, he's probably talking to me because of the, oh, uh, is he? Oh, okay. the face or whatever the heck it is. Yeah, I could do that. Unless you want Nate to do it. I was going to say, I really don't make any uh, fun faces. <laughs> yeah, I do that. No, definitely not talking to me. I don't put my face out there very much. <laughs> <laughs> what, a, what a crowd pleaser. Anything for the views, right? Yeah, dude, for the tubes, man. So, yeah, if anyone's interested, we got five on the three Giannis cards or one dollar on the Jacob Eason. Again, the sealed wax guys is still like dirt cheap. So, if anyone's interested in that, we can rip or ship on that stuff too. I am going to be doing a giveaway on that 91 score. So, we'll do that here at five o'clock here in three. Oh, no, it's is that 57 or 30? It's only 37. We'll do that at five o'clock, guys. He said, just your avatar. Just, just the avatar. I don't know how to just turn my avatar up. <laughs> CVC said, one on Easton. One on Easton, yep. Awesome. Thank you, CVC. Go ahead and start calling it on the Easton. Any interest on the Giannis lot, guys? There's three cards. Two of them are optic. One is base, one is an insert, and the other is essentials.
And uh, hey, what's up, Amy? Good to see you. And just for Macho, boom. There you go, my friend. <laughs> All right, we're going to call sold on the Jacob Eason. That's going to CVC. I really appreciate it. And pull down the Giannis's. Okay, so next lot I'm going to throw up. We're going to start this at a dollar. It's going to be four cards. It's going to be Troy Aikman. This one's a hot numbers insert. This one's really nice and shiny. It's a select. And then we got this Extra Stars by Flair Ultra. Try not to cover up the others, but probably going to happen. There we go. Put him right there. So one dollar on all four of the Troy Aikmans. Anyone's interested? Okay, yeah, no problem, CBC. I'll definitely put it in a stack for you. Yeah, I'll do the same. Anybody bids for me? If you want to stack, go ahead. We can stack up, or just let me know when to ship it. Yeah, it's yeah, it's same same thing here. I, mean, I buy enough off CVC anyway. I could just you know auction credit it, whatever you know, whatever you want to do. There's no biggie either way. Any interest on the Aikmans? I'm gonna start to speed up a little bit. That way we can get through some cards. Or one dollar on four Troy Aikman cards. Cool. Def wants to start a stack too, Paul. Yeah, no problem. Anybody, just I'll stack them up and. Yeah, there's no sense in you guys paying four dollar shipping on like a one dollar purchase. Hey, Frank. Good to see you, man. Appreciate you being here. What's up, Frank? I'm going to go over to Paul. Again, anything that sh has been shown, guys, that you see or that you would want, just let us know, and we can always pull it back out later. Well, I'm trying to get it to it. it doesn't have such a bad glare on it, but this is just a Joe Burrow uh, Leaf draft pick rookie. Uh, I believe this is 2000 or 2020. I'm sorry. Yeah. 2020. Leaf rookie. Start that at a buck if anybody's interested. Anybody's interested on that for a buck, I'll roll on that. If not, I've got a baseball lot come, uh, and a basketball lot that I'll replace up there. All right, don't look like we've got anything going there, so I will put up some. Uh, two contenders. This is a Yachty Molina. This is numbered uh, 60 out of 149. And then I will put up a John Memes. This is also numbered 293 out of 299. Start that at a buck. It's my baseball lot for this round. See if that goes anywhere. That don't go anywhere. I'll throw up some basketball. Dude, that's awesome, Def. He says Burrow's walking already. That's really cool. Uh, Dude, I hope he bounces back. He's a young kid. You know, he'll come back. I've been trying to grade everything I pull with his.
Eric B's here, as Deafness told him. Appreciate you coming in. Hey, I appreciate that, man. Thanks for stopping. Uh, Thanks again, Deafness. I definitely appreciate the shout out, bro. Let's see. You need to come to us. Absolutely. All right. No movement on these contenders, which is just fine. Um, so I'll put up a little shack lot here. Uh, it's a five card shack lot. Started at. Hmm, let's go two on this. It's some base stuff in here and a couple inserts. Well, no, one base and all inserts. So started at two. This is just a 92 93 Fleer. This is a 93 Upper Deck Sky uh, Skylights. Uh, this will be a season leader from the same set here. Um, and there's a 92, 93 tops highlights. Let's so get that to lay in there. And then this is a rebound king from 94, 95 Ultra Pro, or excuse me, Flare Ultra. So, what I say on that two? Yeah, I think I said two bucks on that. I don't remember two or three. I can't remember. Don't matter. If somebody wants it, bid either two or three, and we'll keep going. Mr. CVC looks like he's in it for two, so get rolling on that. Again, thanks everybody for showing up. Where else can you get, you know, five shack cards for two bucks starting off? That highlights one is slick looking too. Or skylights or whatever the heck it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this uh, uh this one is uh, an insert set from that. This is no, it's not. I thought that was in which one? One of these is an insert. In the same series or same set, but yeah, I do PC Shack, but only when he was a Laker, so that's why I offer these ones up. Just like LeBron, most of my Cav LeBrons go up north somewhere. Yep, I can send you my uh, Laker ones too. <laughs> I know. No grand movement on the shack lock here. Shack lock, shack lot here. So go ahead and roll these off to CVC and okie doke. If Nate's ready, if Nate, you're not ready, I can. Yep, looks like he's ready. Some, some baseball five card lot. Josh Bell, Verlander, Snell. See, see the flare. And uh, Blackman, and then this one is Topps Chrome, Chris Br uh, Bryant for the Cubs. Let's start this at four bucks. Okay, four dollars. You get that five card lot there, guys. Anyone's interested, just let us know in the chat. And Nate does have a ton of slabs behind him there. It looks like mainly PSA, it looks like a couple BGS there. Really, uh, fire looking stuff there. Again, they are, you see anything you like there, you ask him, he'll give you the price. Those are buy it now. Cheaper than eBay. I see a neon Steeler light that would look beautiful in my bedroom. <laughs> How much is that? I bought that at Walmart on Clarence, and it, and it I think it stopped working. So I, I, <laughs> it I mean, I was still hanging on the wall. It's, it's like a... It's like a lot of Steeler decoration I have down here. Dude, I look at Steelers everywhere in my house. I know, Frank, man. I'm I'm hurting over the Josh Bell stitch too, man. Hey, at least they got a good parking uh, attendant out of it in that tree. Yeah. The figures of the Pirates trade the only player I probably know on the team. Or yep. Uh, 
What up, Lady Luck Junk? Good to see you. Erica. Awesome to see you. So we're at what four dollars on this lot? Yeah. If anyone's interested, we're at four doll hairs. To the Pittsburgh. Okie doke. Okay, I got a couple different choice lots here. I was fidgeting here, so that's why it's all centered. So, you guys have your choice. We can go with Brett Favre. Let me show you what we got here. Go to Skybox. Score. So, uh, is that Pinnacle Summit? Got a Flare Ultra. Got one of these, like, I don't even know what those are called, Sports Flicks or whatever. Got a checklist. Four-player checklist with him on it. And one of those, like, popped-out cards. I don't know how to explain those, but you guys know what I mean. It's popped out. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Brett Favre cards. We'll start that at $2, guys. $2 on eight Brett Favre cards. For anyone who's interested in that, you can just say Favre 2 or vice versa. We got some Emmett Smiths here. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven Emmett Smiths. Do one dollar on the seven Emmett Smiths. You just say Smith, you know, one dollar or whatever if you're interested in bidding on that one. Or we got some Steve Youngs and we got good bid of him. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Steve Youngs. We'll do start at two dollars on the Steve Young too. So if you're interested in any of those lots, $2, $1, $2. Again, we still have the sealed product. If you're interested, much cheaper than eBay. Jalen Hurts on fire. I bet he is. I'm at 10 points in the first quarter. Five minutes left. <laughs> Good thing you picked him up on your eliminated team, huh? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like your best buddy going into the playoffs, going to pick someone off off the waivers, and uh, noticing your his best buddy uh, went and snatched him for an eliminated squad. Hey, <laughs> this is no one can ever say that there was any favoritism in my leagues. <laughs> Def saw two dollars on the Favre. Yeah, I'd say you're safe on the favoritism, Nate. That's what I'm aiming for. So deafness is in two dollars on the Brett Favre lot. Okay, we're just going to call the Favre sold to deafness at two. And it's no problem. I'll definitely stack these for you. And then you just let me know when you want them shipped. Okay, so Favre's are sold to deafness. Any interest on the Emmets or the Steve Youngs? 
Let's add one more stack set aside. I'll just throw up there real quick. This is going to be a nice one here. This is uh, this is going to be a goat stack right here. We're going to start this bad boy off at two bucks as well. Jerry Rice tops all pro. Jerry Rice select. Jerry Rice pinnacle. Jerry Rice score second effort. Jerry Rice again, score second effort. Got a pro line, Jerry Rice. Tops, all pro Jerry Rice. It's a 1988. I don't know if that's what his third year or something like that. 1,000 yard club, Jerry Rice. That is a 89. So that entire rice lot is $2 as well, if anyone's interested in that. If not, we can head over to Paul. No one's interested in any of these lots. And again, guys, if there's something you see that we pass by for time's sake that you would like us to bring back. You just let us know. Okay. So deafness wants the rice at $2. Awesome. Any advance on that? We're going to go ahead and start calling it to him on that. So we can keep cycling through the cards. Just because deafness is the man. We're going to throw a cat in on top of that just for, because I know that's his dude. All right, we're going to call sold on the rice lot. And I'm going to pull up Paul now. Got a single baseball here, 1999 Bowman, a rookie favorite of the year. This is actually an Adrian uh, Beltre. Start that one at a buck if anybody's interested in that. Again, this is 99 Bowman. Start that bad boy at a dollar. Too much of a glare. I gotta get something to get that glare off of there. Hunter, stop it. Well, that's marinating. I'm going to throw up a... Let's see. This is a 2018. Uh, number 206 of 299 uh, from the Seattle Seahawks. This is an origin. Doug Baldwin. Start that at a buck, too. But he wants that one. So both of those up for a dollar a piece, just say one, one Beltron or one Baldwin roll with whichever one gets the bid first. And if not, got a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 card um, basketball lot that I'll throw up. Okay, 
look seem like we have interest on either one of those so i'll go you know put uh these up let's believe is tops 1979 tops basketball start with a uh marcus lucas a artist gilmore ml carr uh, Doug Collins, uh, Walter Davis, Nate Tiny Archibald, uh, Bernard King. What about Nate Tiny Dizzy? <laughs> uh, <laughs> this would be uh, the Iceman George Gervin, Pistol Pete Merivich, uh, a Wes Unsaid, a uh, Bob McAdoo, and a Dennis Johnson rookie. Start that at a $5 spot. That Dennis Johnson rookie, uh, Nate, you might have seen that before. I just sent that to Nate to uh, submit with our grading. So that should be somewhere in Pittsburgh right now waiting to get sent to PSA. You know. So again, those are tops 1979. 12 card lot. Um, I got th uh, these cards, by the way. Maybe, uh, see how everything connects up. I've got uh, a lot of these 1979s from, uh, uh, oh gosh, his name just escaped me. Storage Auction Pirate, Mike. Hey, DJ. So, uh, Thanks for being here, bud. So he passed. I got these on a great deal. Um, actually, I got a huge lot of these, and, and I've actually got doubles and triples of some of these. Um, and, and actually the pistol Pete, I've got seven of those, uh, but, uh, he sold it to me for a real good price and I'm passing that good price on to you. He's All right, so we put a, a five dollar starting price on that. Anybody interested can go through them again if anybody wants me to. I'm trying to look something up here, make sure I am calling these. These are actually, I believe, I called these wrong. These are 1978. I apologize, everybody. <laughs> that Dennis Johnson, by the way, just looking up right now. Um, uh, the comps are between eight and twelve dollars just for that Dennis Johnson. Nice. Now here's one here's one for five, but still, I mean PSA eight in that is uh just sold for eighty nine dollars. PSA nine sold for a one twenty five. And there's another PSA nine sold for two seventy eight. Anybody interested in these? We do got a uh, five dollar bid to DJ. No, we did. Okay, I didn't see that. Yeah. yeah. Any advance? Not. We're gonna start to call it down to DJ. Got you, DJ. I'm sorry. I didn't see that. I came back. I was, I didn't, I, for some reason I said 1979 and I, in my head, I was like, no, wait, that's not right. So I went, look, it is, they are 1978. Again, 1978, Dennis Johnson, Bob McIndoo, Wes Unstead, Pistol Pete, uh, Iceman, Bernard King, Tiny Archibald, Walter Davis, Doug Collins, uh, ML Carr, Artis Gilmore, and Marcus Lucas. Five dollar on that. Hey Clint, good to see you, man. Thanks so much for being here. 
Jeff, are you going live at 6 p.m. today or 7 p.m. today, Eastern? Let me double check. So I want to make sure we drop that and promote that for you. CBC, we already have a $5 bid from DJ. So if you want to jump it up. Def says 7 o'clock, so we'll be done. In awesome. Then. Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely uh, be done, and we'll be sending people your way. What's going on, Clint? How are you, buddy? Thanks for showing up. Guys, I'm going to drop a link in the chat, too. This is Defness's channel. If you guys haven't checked out his channel yet make sure you do he does auctions like we're doing right now every single tuesday and he does other kind of sports card content he does you know uh daily fantasy sports and stuff like that so definitely check him out if you haven't really awesome generous dude cvc comes in with a six dollars And an auction breaks out with DJ for seven. So they say they exchange greetings and then bid against each other. No <laughs> friends at an auction. Who's in the lot again? Okay, we got a uh, Marquise Lucas, which is this one. Artist Gilmore. Uh, ML Carr. Uh, this one is a Doug Collins. Um, this one is a Walter Davis, but I will point out, it does have a slight crease right there. Uh, Tiny Archibald. Or Nate for your Buffalo Braves, by the way. Uh, Bernard King. Uh, Iceman, George Gervin. Uh, Pistolier Pete, Pistol Pete there for the, uh, the Jazz. Wes Unsaid. And a Bob McAdoo. And a rookie of... Uh, Dennis Johnson, and it does have a right there above the S. There is a uh, dark spot. I don't think that's, I believe that's on card. It's not from the saver. Yep, that's on the card itself. So there is a little dark spot above the S there. Hey, Amy. Good to see you. Appreciate you being in here.
CBC, I may have an extra one of those. Let me check my stack here. See if I have an extra Bernard King. Is that what he said? Bernard King? Yeah. Card of Collins. So we're at 11 to CVC. Hey, Burger King's a cool guy. Make some nice sandwiches. Are we finished with this lot? Looks like we might be. Yeah, I think we are at. Oh, yeah, no, no worries, Clint. I like jokes of all types. Shaq Rat, what's up, buddy? Thanks for coming. Hey, Shaq. Shaq Rack, one of the uh, nicest guys in the community. Anytime you're in a chat or hang out with him or anything like that, uh, he's always saying hi to everybody, giving everybody them smiley faces with the horns up. DJ's at 12. CVC says yeah, DJ can um, take it. Yeah, I have, I have uh, four of them. Um, however, the one in this lot is in the best condition. So I do have four extra, or excuse me, three extra ones. However, the one in this lot is in the best condition. Um, CVC, you want me to just uh, pick you out the best condition one and send it to you? Um, so we'll go ahead and... Uh, Sell this off to DJ. All right, I'm gonna pull up Nate. Five card football rookie lot. Chase Young, DJ Johnson Swift, Joe Burrow, DK Dobbins, Cole Clement. Five cards, five dollars. Okay, we got anyone in on here? We got five dollars. Uh, CVC was asking. Yeah, I responded to him. Oh, okay. I didn't want to confuse anybody by saying it, so 
Oh, yeah. So he's asking five for the entire lot. I think he was asking for the last three of the cards. Okay, so it's sold as one lot. Is that what you're saying, Nate? Yeah, all no. five cards. Five bucks. No, I think CVC was asking me for the three Bernard Kings that I have left. Oh, gotcha. So I believe that's what he was asking. Oh, gotcha. My bad. I just confused everything. Yeah. It's kind of what I do. It's what I do best. Any answers? If not, we'll go to Pittsburgh. Oh, you Pittsburgh. Okie doke. All right, guys. So I got a few different lots here. Uh, this is a rookie lot here from Illusions. We're going to start this off at $4 for six cards. So we got Jake Fromm, AJ Dillon, Joshua Kelly, Brandon Ayuk. T. Higgins, and Cole Komet. So you get all six of those starting at $4. That's the first lot I have up. I have another one here. This is Van Jefferson's rookie. We're going to start this one off at $2. Then I have the uh, Sapphire exclusive rookie of his. And then I'm throwing in two other exclusive sapphires as well, which is uh, Julian Edelman and Jimmy G. But really, these are the two main ones you want. Starting that off at $2 for the Jefferson lot. So four, two, and then $2 on the quarterback lot as well. So you're getting Josh Allen from Prestige 19. You're getting a score 19 Russ. An Optic 19 Russ. You're getting a Score 19 Tom Brady. Score 19 Aaron Rodgers. And a Donruss 2020 Aaron Rodgers as well. So six cards there. Two bucks as well. So any of those lots you guys are interested in, just let us know. It's four, two, and two. Anyone is interested. And it is actually past five o'clock. So we are going to pick someone to give this away to. So if you guys could just any number between one and 200, we're going to use a card for the number to give for the winner. So, you guys can go ahead and start guessing numbers whenever, and whoever's closest to the number without going over will win between 1 and 200. You guys can guess, too, if you want. It's up to you. Triple O's. Uh, Deftness, I got the triple zeros already. Yep. Give it just another second. Again, if anyone's interested in any of those lots, just let me know. All right, so this is going to be the card that the giveaway is going to be on. Whatever the number is on the back of that, whoever's closest to that will get the pack of cards. So without further ado... 118. 
So closest to 118 without going over is Kenneth at uh, 27. Awesome. So this is yours, man. Uh, I can either ship it to you like this and you can open it yourself or we can open it for you and ship it, ship you the cards out of it. So it's up to you, Kenneth, whatever you'd want to do, man. Switch back over to Paul. Wow. Wait on that. Wow, that's a nice lot. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, okay. Something. Everything on my screens are so far as froze up here. All right. Uh, Kenneth says open it. So if you want to go ahead and flip back to you and open it. Sure. I can do that. All right. Let's see what we can find for you. Grab my sleeves too. So hopefully we'll get something worth sleeving up for you. Yeah, yeah, DJ, you won the uh, 78 basketball lot. Okay, so you got a Steve Jordan, Tim Krumry, Jerry Gray, Matt Millen, Randall Cunningham. Oh, there's an insert face. Who we got here? This is a Viking. Def should know this guy. Joey Browner. Dream team, strong safety. It's pretty cool looking. Byron Evans. Curtis Duncan. Keith McKellar. Ben Smith. Ethan Horton. Mark Murphy. Not the green. So I don't know if these are special parallels or not. They change colors, unless that's just team color. Oh, no, maybe it is special because they're green. Mark Murphy, Paul Grubber. <laughs> that said, that dude's a prick. <laughs> <laughs> Gil Bird and Jackie Slater. He does kind of look like he'd be a prick, huh? <laughs> so I'll stick that in a stack for you. Uh, do you want me to send you the wrapper too? Oh, that sucks. All right, so I'm going to go back to Paul. Jonathan Taylor lot. That thing is amazing. Yep, I got a Jonathan Taylor lot. Um, got a four card lot here. We're gonna start it um, at big old. I don't know. We'll go with three on that. Well, we got our playoff rookie wave. Um, I think I pulled this last week in a box opening. Then the rated rookie as well. This is a prism. All right, this is an elite series. Don Russ on that one. And then uh, this is the regular uh, Don Russ rated rookie. So you're going to get all four cards starting at a $3. It's a nice deal.
So you get definite in at four dollars. Definitely been at 10. Got a little bit of a auction here going on. Any more advance on this? If not, we'll. Uh... Looks like uh, CBC decided to drop out, so sell those off to uh, Deafness. Throw a quick lot uh, of two card uh, 2018 19 Prism Dominance. Um, Says a Prism of. Oh, oh. And get it on the card stand without throwing it across the table there. Started at a dollar there with uh, Paul Pierce as well as a, a base Akeem Elijah one. So we'll go a buck on that if anybody wants that. If not, I got a, a little baseball, I believe it's a four or five card baseball lot. All right, don't see nothing on that, so pull those down, and I'll put up a one, two, three, four, five card um, Kyle Lewis lot at two. Uh, this is going to all be based, by the way, two that start at a dollar to Kyle Lewis uh, from Tops Gallery, a Kyle Lewis uh, from Tops Update, Kyle Lewis from. Uh, the Diamond Kings, and then we'll do a, a Kyle Lewis from Prism. And start all five cards here. It's five cards, but it's four different ones. Started at a buck. Get you some Kyle Lewis. Any Kyle Lewis fans out there? Got Kenneth in it a buck. I see that. Just getting ready to say it. Thank you. 
right, no more movement on that. Let's sell those off to Kenneth for one big dollar. Awesome. And uh, we can kick it on down the road to, I believe, it's Nate's turn. Right. Nate, you ready? Do you want me to pop something up? Yeah, you can pop something up. All right, guys. So I have a few different options here for you. All lots here. So this one right here we're going to start with is going to start at $5. These are baseball cards from somewhere in the 70s. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, Paul or one of you baseball guys out there might know a little bit more about these than you know than I do. But let me move some of this stuff out the way so I can show you these. We're going to start this entire stack off at just $5. I said i don't know a whole lot about these but they all have like little signatures now i don't think it's real i think these are i don't know if you'd call that like a facility or whatever the heck it is but every single one of these has some kind of signature on it they all got like some kind of five of 33 type thing on there as well so we're gonna hey mark good to see you man appreciate you being here so we got this james fragoski and again, I'm not a super big baseball guy, so forgive me if I'm going to butcher some of these names. Those yeah. are before my time, so I can't help you. Rick Monday. Rusty Staub. Frank Howard. Kurt Wilhelm. Kurt Flood. Tommy Helms. Again, guys, this whole stack is five dollars. Felipe Alou. I know that name. Got Ken Harrelson. Don Kessinger. Bill Freehand. Tommy Davis. Lewis uh, Taint. <laughs> Luis Alpar Kiko, Mari Willis or Wills, Bug Pow. <laughs> I approve of that name. El Ferrer, Jerry Kuzman, Danny McLean, Joe Foy, Richie Allen. So, again, I don't know any of these players, but $5 for an entire set from the 70s that are in black and white and die cut. Don't think that's too bad of a deal. So, that's a $5 set there, guys. If anyone's interested, we'll do start at $2 on the Sandy Alomars. Let me show you these ones. We got a Flare Ultra. We got a – what kind of is this? Is upper Deck. Upper Deck. The top's finest. Got a tops. Another one. It's a, another tops all star. Upper deck collector's choice. Another Ken, tops all star. Kenneth Moore is asking if you'll do four on. I believe that. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Sold four dollars, Kenneth. I'll stick that in with your other cards. Um, then we got this one right here, Sandy Olimar. Got a score. Another collector's choice, a different one. So total, this was a two dollar lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven Alomars. Hey, you're welcome, Kenneth. No problem. So, uh, eleven Sandy Alomars. Get the last one to stick. I got a Kenny Lofton lot here. Also at $2. So we got an upper deck. Got a Kenny Lofton uh, tops here. We got a another upper deck. We got this tops. This I don't know if that's a rookie or not, is it? It has one year with the Astros, but I'm not sure if that's a rookie. That might be. Could be, I don't know. Paul, do you know if that's his rookie? Uh, show it to me again. I'm sorry. Uh, this Kenny Lofton here? It shows one-year stats with the Astros. 
Possibly. I'm not sure. It could be a second year. Well, it's either second year or first year. One oh, first of the year. Oh, excuse me. First year. I'm sorry. We have a league leaders insert here. Stolen, stolen bases. We have a bat patrol insert. All-star gold. Tops gold. A pinnacle. And just a regular tops version. You see the difference between the gold and the regular. So this lot here is $2. 2 dollars one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Kenny Lofton cards. Then if anyone's interested in this, I was gonna start this one off at eight bucks. This is a Jalen Rigger lot and it's got some fire in it. So you got a turning pro patch. You have the uh, red cracked ice from Prism. You have basically the rainbow from Illusions. This is a numbered 11 out of 149 gold. And then I don't know if this is chrome, copper, whatever color that is. Then we have the base one from Illusions. And we have his score rookie. So that was going to be six Rieger cards starting at eight bucks. If anyone's interested in that. Those are the locks we have right now. Anyone's interested, just let me know which one you want, and it's yours. I also have a Jerry Judy lot for $1. These are all Leaf. It's a base, All-American insert, and a Touchdown Kings insert. All three Jerry Judy rookie cards are at $1 as well. Those are the options, guys. Just let us know. Should you be interested in any of those? Guys, I'm going to go ahead and send this over to Nate. I'm not ready yet, man. Go ahead, get a pull. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Um, I've got a four card lot here, playoff 2020. This is um, behind the numbers, a Michael Thomas and a Peyton Manning. A Clyde Edwards and a, whoop, and a uh, Emmett Smith. Started that at good old two bucks on that. Let's see if there's any interest in that. And if there's not, I will can pop. Chat died because I haven't seen any movement in our chat in a while. Let me refresh. Yeah, no, I haven't seen any either. Any interest in these by the numbers inserts, guys? 
Okay, now I see some people typing, so. Hey, thank you guys. Appreciate it. That's helpful. <laughs> Maybe it's just that we're not putting up good stuff. Two bucks. Starting this at two. Again, it's a Michael Thomas, Peyton Manning. Uh, what was that? Clyde Edwards and a Emmett Smith. 2020 playoff. Two bucks. All right, take these down. Def got them for two bucks. I'll put up a three card lot now. I believe this is last year's prism uh, inserts or part of, I'm not sure if they're part of the base. Um, or excuse me, last year's mosaic. Uh, this is a Drew Holiday give and go. A Ricky, Ricky Rubio give and go. And then a Kyrie. Irvin, give and go. Start that at a dollar. No movement on this dollar. Uh, start this, uh, starting on a dollar and this give and goes from Mosaic 2018, 19, I believe it is. Don't check on that. Nope, 1920 give and goes. Sorry. Starting out of a, at a buck. If not, uh, I got a four card baseball lot I'll put up here. Pull these down. Uh, top Series 1s from 2020. Vlad Guerrero. 2020 Bowman, or excuse me, 2019 Bowman Platinum. All right. Vlad Guerrero. Uh, Don Russ Optic. 2020. Vlad Guerrero. 2020 Tops Gallery, uh, 138 to 250. Modern Artist, Vlad Guerrero. Start that at three.
Starting these ones here again. These are four card Vlad Guerrero lot. Starting off at big old three bucks. Top series one, uh, Bowen Platinum, uh, Don Russ Optic, and that is uh, Tops Gallery 2020, numbered one something or another, 138 at 250. Anyone interested in any higher dollar stuff? I've been pulling mainly lower dollar stuff, but if anyone would like to see slabs or anything like that, just let us know. So we have that kind of stuff as well. All right, I don't see nothing on that. Um, I'll test the waters here on this one. Two card lot here. Uh, hope you guys are prepared. Um, got a couple of insert cards from playoff. Uh, first one is 2020 playoff. Cold arms. Jordan Love. And same thing. Cold arms. Herbert, I'm going to start this one off at five. Let that marinate there for 30 seconds or so. If not, one of the other two guys can move on. Holy crap, Carolina's defense is putting up 22 points right now. Dang it, Paul. Tell your team not to do that. My team played yesterday. I know, with your local team. <laughs> CBC and it fits right now. Oh, well, there we go. Okay. Yeah, we're going to need uh, Washington to put up some points and not be from Gibson. How about Big Ben giving me 25 points? Shout out to my man Nate Dizzy on that one. So we're still at six to CVC. Is anyone yeah. else interested in this lot? I was getting ready to call it to him, and if anybody else wanted this. Yeah, I love the uh, Chromium playoff cards this year. Yeah, I like those too. I was telling Nate, I think I'm just going to end up ripping this last cello myself, just to, like hoping to pull like that exact card right there, like a Herbert or something like that, you know? Yep, this was, I was going to put this in my hold or grade box, but decided to bring it up for you guys. All right, so I'll call this to Mr. CVC for six, and one of you two gentlemen can take over. Sounds good. I'm going to go one more time because I know Nate's in the middle of doing something. So I'm going to throw up some uh, Prism Draft Picks lots. So these these are going to all start. Oh, Deafness um, came in at seven. CVC went to eight, Paul. Okay. You want to keep going on it? We can if you want. That's completely up to you. I mean, it's your, your option. So you, you call that one. That's tough. <laughs>
So are we on eight on this one, or what do you want to what do you want to do here, Paul? Uh, I didn't when I said sold. I, I wasn't paying attention to the chat, so I don't know if those bid that bid came in after I sold. Death is out, so yeah, it would be CVC at eight would be the top bid. Okay. So do you want to sell that at eight, or what do you want to do? He's out at his eight. Okay. No, I'll give it to uh, um, Dev says give I'll, it to him for six. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll give it to him for six okay. because yeah, I, I wasn't paying attention when I said sold. I wasn't seeing uh, anything. So yeah, I'm gonna give it to him for six. Cool. So the next thing I'm gonna show you guys, these all started a dollar. These are uh, Prism Draft Picks lots. First one is Patrick Williams, the number four overall pick to the Bulls. Tyrese Halliburton and Sadiq Bay. So those three for one dollar. Next three for one dollar is a Jaden McDaniels lot, starting with this purple pulsar. Those are like one per box. Then uh, you get his crusade and his base. Then we got an Aaron Naismith lot. He's the newest rookie for the Celtics. Dude's a deadly three point shooter. So we have both of his base cards. And we have his Crusade. Again, that's a $1 lot as well. And then I got this one here. It's Robert Woodard Green, Precious Achua Crusade, and Onyeka Okongwu Crusade. So Precious has been looking pretty good this year too. So if anyone's interested in any of those, those are a dollar per lot. You just let me know which one you want, and it's yours. Bunch of brand new basketball rookies. So if anyone is interested in those, you just let me know which one at one dollar and it's yours. Hey Kel, you're flipping mama in the house. Good to see you. Okay, A B says the football break is not gonna fill. That sucks, man. Any interest in the Prism Draft Picks cards? If not, we can definitely uh, go on to something else. I do have other cards handy here. Another card lot we could start off at $1 for four Nolan Ryans. Two of them being holograms. That'd be one dollar on the Nolans as well. If anyone's interested in Nolan Ryan. Also got where the heck did I put it? An entire stack here of Albert Bell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I got eleven Albert Albert Bell cards. If anyone's interested in any of his stuff? That's a blue. Just gonna show that stuff off. The Albert Bells all started a dollar too. The entire stack of 11 cards. The Bowman's best here. Get that OG Joey Bell. What year are the Ryans? Let me check for you. CBC, you were at, jeez, uh, I just counted it up. Hold on a minute. CBC, you're at a buck for me. 
it would be like five counting shipping, but like I said, you don't have to do the uh, shipping now anyway. We can stack it if you want. Or we can just do, you know, auction credit and stuff because I'm going to end up buying from you anyway. The Nolans here are 1993 on these two. CBC are at 14 with me without the shipping so far. So if you want me to hold it, I'll hold it. These are also 93. So all four of them are upper deck 93. So those would be a dollar for all four of them if you're interested in the Nolans. All right. Sounds good, CVC. I'd do the same thing for Deafness, too, because I pretty much buy from his auction as well. So any of you guys, I'm not worried about that. AB, what breaks do you have uh, available right now? You said the uh, football is not gonna, not gonna happen. I know you said you have baseball and prism draft. You don't have, do you have any other uh, footballs or basketballs you're looking to fill? Hey, AB, if you've got a website, uh, you've got a wrench, so just drop your link down there. See if we can get it filled up for you. Oh, you got anything you want to throw up, Paul? Yeah, yeah. Um, I just got a four card, uh, great expectations lot. Uh, the Guga, is that how you pronounce that man's name? Goga. Goga. Um, Put a little respect on his name, Paul. <laughs> I'm not a Cav. And then there's another one, one of those long. Me fondue, Cabin Galley. There you go. What what Anthony said. Uh, Chuma. Is that how you spell that, say that guy's name? A Chuma Okiki. Yeah. Uh, this is going to start at a dollar and a Luke uh, Sam, Samnick. From the, so that'll start at a buck. Hey, boy. Luca, wrong one. Yep. Start that one at a dollar if anybody wants to start on that. No, got any Tampa Rays? Um, I've got some uh, Brandon McKee. Got a bunch of those, bunch of McKee stuff, shirts and bases. If you're interested in any any of that stuff, got got a stack of his stuff that I can pull out of here and run through if you would like. Let me check some of my baseball stuff. All of my. Baseball stuff's in a different box. All right, no, no moving on the great expectations lot. So we'll go on to another playoff rookie wave. Chase Young, start at a dollar, as well as a Denzel Mims. So start that lot at one dollar hair. Yeah, I really like those rookie waves. Yes, McKay. I'm sorry. Yeah, I got this is a big stack of McKays I have here, Clint. I can run through that. You let me know if you want any of those. We'll
no movement on the rookie wave. And um, Clint, did you want to see these uh, Brandon uh, McKay I have? I'll can pop some of those up as well. Not. Oh, well, Jeff was asking how much, Paul. Oh, for the rookie wave? A dollar a piece, Steph, I believe. No, it was a dollar for both on the oh, rookie okay. wave. If you want the rookie wave, they're a dollar. I'm sorry, Def, I missed that. Those, where did they go? Those on the pass. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do a buck on that. On these rookie ways, if you wanted to do that. Uh, deafness will take them. All right. Going to deaf. Yeah, no problem, deaf. It's understandable, man. And Clint shows the thumbs up, so I'll throw a couple of these um, Brandon keys up. Um, I believe this is from 2020 Don Russ. It's the pink firework, I believe that's what it's called. Another pink firework. Uh, that is the rookies here. Um, gallery, foil, got the foilage on there, and uh, then just the regular one. If you are interested in those four, I'll do I'll do a two dollar start on those. Do have some other ones if you're not interested in those. Twenty certified from Chronicles. Uh, is that Prism? No, it's not Prism. Sorry, just a foil. Donruss Optic. Uh, and then, just I uh, believe this is also Chronicles. Uh, then just a uh, regular base mosaic. Chronicle status as well here. It's another one I have. And I believe this comes from Top's Gallery, but it is the retro or throwback. Uh, no, uh, yeah, the Top's Gallery Heritage. So got that one there. So you let me know which ones you're interested in. Um, and then I got some doubles of some stuff already up there. So. they all fell off. Wants to know what I want for the stat. Let's see here. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, eight. There's 13 cards. Uh, I'll do 
do 10 bucks for all of them if you want them all. You want the doubles? If you don't want the doubles, I'll give you a different price. But these three here are doubles. So I've got doubles of those. If you don't want those ones, I'll give you a different pr price. But if you want all of them, I'll do, what did I just say? Did I say 10? And if you don't want the doubles, I'll do... He doesn't want doubles. All right. Um, about we'll do uh, do eight. How about that? Knock two bucks off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So ten cards for eight bucks. And I'll start my McKees collection over again. To McKay, I'm sorry. Keep calling him McKee. It's McKay. I'm going to do believe, uh, gentlemen, this will be my last lot, and he's going to take those because uh, I have a birthday dinner to go to. Awesome, man. Yeah, we're just going to be on a little while longer, and then Deafness45 is going to be going live, guys, at 7 p.m. Eastern. Uh, Nate does have a lot ready to go. I'm going to go over to him. And I'll right. put everything you have there, Nate. All them little slabby slabs. All right, so this is going to be a bot now type situation on each slab. <laughs> Giannis, uh, 2018 Silver Prism, PSA 9, $5. John <laughs> Moran, draft picks. It's PSA 9. We'll do it for 30. Kobe, Hidden Gems, PSA 8. We'll do 45. Ben Simmons, Prestige, 9.5. Beckett, we'll do 60. Um, yeah. Clint wants to know if you're on Twitter, uh, Paul. Or do you leave already? No, he's still there. Okay. I'm sorry. I uh, was muted. I was placing my birthday order. So. I do know if you're on Twitter. Yeah. Uh, at Gate City Picker. Oh. Hold on. I got these cards all mixed up here. Post it fell off. Kenneth was asking how much he owes. Uh, to me, Kenneth, it's just. Uh, it'd be four dollars plus four shipping, unless you'd want to stack. Then we can square up on the shipping, you know, later, and I can wait to ship it to you. It's up to you. If you'd want to wait to get more, you know, heavy cards in, so you're not just <coughs> shipping that one little lot. It's up to you, though. Let me know either way. You can either hold or, you know, do whatever you want. Kenneth, let me see what I have for you, bud. Anyone interested in any of the graded stuff on Nate's table? I really like that Ben Simmons prestige. I feel like prestige is a little bit underrated as far as like pops and stuff go. Uh, Kenneth, right now I've got you down for three bucks plus the shipping, but of course I'll stack it for you if you want. Save you on some shipping for next week or down the road yeah, i only got you down for three bucks right now i got you two dollars on the sam hillard uh, redemption and uh, one dollar on the kyle lewis lot it's like some of, these, some of these stickers fell off my cards but i think i uh i think i got everything back on here how they're supposed to be what was that eight i so you can go okay so I'm going to show you guys a couple different lots I have here. So, again, I just pulled this back out because I know we have some new people. $1 for four-card Kawhi lot. Anyone's interested in that, it's a pretty good deal. This lot right here is going to be $5 because it starts with a patch. But it's going to be four rookie running backs, starting with a DeAndre Swift. Nice big chunky patch. Got a AJ Dillon, 
J.K. Dobbins, and a Joshua Kelly. Again, all four of these start off at $5. If anyone's interested in that, it's a really nice young rookie lot. we got a Vikings lot here. We're going to start this off at $1 for four parallels. You got three pink camos and one green. Harrison Smith, Kyle Rudolph, Danielle Hunter, and Kirk Cousins. So you start your Vikings rainbow right there. And then we got a lot of rookie cards here. I have two DeAndre Hunter, one Cam Johnson for one dollar. Mosaic rookies. So if anyone is interested in any of those lots, just go ahead and let me know. Oh yeah, no, no worries, Kenneth. Um, so you owe me four dollars. That's Pittsburgh. Um, the guy whose channel it is, um, then you owe Paul $3, who's Gate City Picker. Uh, if, if, if it's easy for you, you can just shoot me an email. I can send you an invoice or whatnot. And then you just let us know if you'd like to stack or whatnot. And we could we can hold stuff if you'd rather wait till you have a little bit more, you know, take advantage of the shipping prices and stuff. It's up to you. So if anyone's interested... Again, one, 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 five for that lot. If anyone's interested, we still do have two of these bad boys. Yeah, no problem, Kenneth. I appreciate you being here, man. Appreciate all you guys coming in. Big shout out to Deafness for letting a lot of you guys know about it. I'll show you guys a couple other things that I had out a little earlier. This is another $1 lot mosaics. Uh, you have two Kyrie inserts and a KD base for $1. Warcraft, what up, man? Yeah, no problem, man. Dude, how does Warcraft not have a wrench right here? That's like a travesty on this channel. My bad. Warcraft, you have... Um, let, me, Clint, let me give you a wrench, too, so that way you can add the email and everything. I appreciate you being here, Warcraft. Show you guys a couple other lots here. This lot's a five dollar lot just because it's got some nice stuff in it. It's Carl Malone. Check that out. 88 Flare. Such a classic set. How sick is that? Got an in the key insert. I always like those cards. Those in the key ones are real nice. Yep. And Fuego. I love these ones. And then we've got the reprint of his rookie. You know what? I thought I had more cards in this lot. So let's just go down to $3 on that lot. My bad. I thought I had like eight cards in that lot. I only have five. I'm going to say three bucks on that lot for the whole thing. Paul Clint gave you his email in the chat. Oh, Warcraft, look what I found, man. I got these uh, set aside for you for uh, next time I ship to you. Found a couple Odell's. Those will go in my next War Warcraft stack. You got any Patrick Ewing fans in the house? Do a three dollar lot on Patrick Ewing as well. More of that beautiful eighty eight flair. I love this set, guys. That's just like so classic to me. Got a 
Patrick Ewing Thunder and Lightning insert. As John Starks on the other end. In the key. And again, the, this entire lot is going to be $3. Hologram. Another Patrick Ewing. Upper deck. This is a uh, promo here. It's like an educational promo card type thing. And an upper deck for an exchange. So that entire, what is that, seven card lot is $3 as well if anyone's interested in some Ewing. I love that 88 flare. I really think that's going to be the next set to pop because a lot of people are already starting to get priced out of that second year Jordan in, in uh, 87. So 88, that's going to be the next one to go, and then that set's going to pick up. That's my guess, at least. Like, I'm not saying, like, thus say it the Lord, or this is going to definitely happen. That's just what I think is going to happen. Got some Chucks here, if anyone's interested in a little Sir Charles. We can do uh, two bucks on the Charles Barkley lot, if anyone's interested in that. We got the Flair All Stars 90. This one is awesome. I love this set. It's another one from, I believe, 88 Flair. Yep. Here's a uh, red All Star game Legend Sports Memorabilia. Old school hoops. It says rookie, it's not. That's just a sleeve I recycled. Then we have the OG Skybox. I love this set. That's just so classic. Like the kind of stuff I was ripping as a kid. We got two bucks on Sir Charles, if anyone's interested in him. Nate, you have anything else you want to show off? Uh, I think that's it for tonight. Okay. Yeah, this was uh, about the last of the box I had, too. You know, unless you guys wanted to look at any slabs or anything like that, I could go through. But, guys, I appreciate everyone coming out and hanging out with us this afternoon. And we will be doing this every week, the three of us just kind of uh, shuffling through cards and trying to give you guys the best deals we can. Appreciate every one of you. If you could, hit that thumbs up for me and the subscribe button on your way out would definitely mean a lot. But, guys, until next time. Also, check out uh, Nate and Paul, too. I have both of their links down below as well. And, Nate, if you could throw your link in the chat, just for anyone that's not subscribed to you to check your channel out, too, because me and Nate are going to be going back and forth every week on each other's channels. And then we'll be going on Paul's, too, once he hits 100 on his channel as well. So, again, guys, we appreciate you, and we'll see you later. Later, guys.